Hi, in this version of Lazing is Amazing, we're going to look at a perculectomy. In this particular case, you can see a 16-year-old girl with a second molar where there's a distal tag over top of the surface, the occlusal surface. The tooth was starting to get some decay. We use the laser 1.4 watts in continuous wave in a stitching type motion up and down to remove the tissue tag that was lying over top of the distal of this tooth. You can try and drag the laser over top of the tissue, repeatedly going deeper and deeper. But what I find is that this tissue is fairly thick, fairly keratinized, and not the easiest to remove. If you want to use a uh, constantly going deeper into the tissue back and forth motion, I would encourage you to raise the settings perhaps up to 2 or even higher watts, but you may find that you're going to get more charring of the tissue. So after repeatedly going up and down, I grabbed the tissue tag with a pair of cotton pliers and tried to make more of a distal wedge shape going back and forth and gradually the piece was able to be removed. You can see there's some slight tissue tags but the whole occlusal surface of the molar has been cleared and now there is a greater ease for the patient to clean. So in order to clean up these tissue tags, one of the things I prefer is hydrogen peroxide. I use this in an ultra-dense syringe with a um, brush of it. This is obtained from uh, ultra-dent. And scrub it back and forth. You'll notice the charring or little uh, brown spots slowly disappear. And then I like to take a wet cotton pellet over top. And you can see the result here at medium magnification, immediately post-operative, and at high magnifications. I want to thank you. This is another edition of